Hey guys, welcome back to another video. And today we're gonna be playing some more um, YBA. And today, so um, I got a few comments on my last YBA video. Um, I had a video below that people were wondering why would I do it with just um, Star Platinum over Heaven because it's like, I mean, Star Plat Requiem because it's you know it's like other people have other stands you know like so why would I do it with just that you know they wanna they wanna get a stand they wanna know how to beat him. Not just that stand. So, I'm going to be doing this to show you guys um, a plenty of other tactics and stands that you can use to beat Diavolo. The reason I did it like that was to just show where you find the quest and pretty much how you'll be fighting him. But I'm going to do this a lot more in depth. So, Zahando, in my opinion, would probably be the best stand to beat him. It just does so much damage and um, it is just OP. So, um, Zahando is a good option. You could probably beat him with Sex Pistols, to be truthful. Mm, I don't know, though. It, it really depends. You would have to have a lot of skill. You have a lot of skill of dodging. Honestly, you most likely could, using a tactic. I don't know if I showed this in my other video. I'll have to check later. But I, um, the ladder tactic, pretty sure I did show it. But what you pretty much do is you'll just pretty much get on that ladder. So, you'll hit him, and you fall down. You'll get up on that ladder, and then he'll... He'll fall down as well. He'll try teleporting up to you. And you can block it. Um, okay, I'm just remembering the moves real quick. Let me check out the moves, guys. Hold up. That's Racer. And we got a Racer 2. And we got F is for the block. Okay. I think I got this down. I think I got this down. I'm gonna wait for my Racer 2 to come back real quick. But yeah. Um, you can honestly beat this with a lot of different stands, except for maybe, probably not Beach Boy. Uh, probably not, I would say Beach Boy, but pretty much like any stand can most likely beat this. I'm, um, I probably, let's see, so as you guys can see here, I have, um, Scary Monsters, Scary Monsters can do the same. So yeah, if you guys get a Sans Corpse, I'll probably, I'm gonna be giving away the Sans Corpse, I don't know. Cause I honestly don't use it, so yeah, we're just gonna, I'm just gonna show you guys how overpowered this is real quick before... We get more into the stands for this, so let's just start it off with the racer. Let's rush him back. His rush is gonna run out first. Eraser him again. Then oh, I forgot um, I could use vamp. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Very much not used to the controls. Uh, whatever, it don't matter. So see, you could just get on this ladder and allow yourself to heal. You can also use pose up here. And as you can see, since I'm a vampire, I got full like immediately. And you could just fall down. And if you don't fail like that, you can beat him. It's not. It's still not easy, honestly. Time stop stand would be good for this because then you could just time stop. You just wait on the ladder and time stop any second. And I got hit by his loot. I'm actually getting destroyed. Oh I need to use the ladder tactic. There you go. I'm gonna uh, let myself heal up a bit before I do that. Before, before I go down again. I really don't remember these controls. Very very rusty. I just got on this game. But yeah, let's just wait here until I'm at full HP. So he's gonna attack again, and then I can just pose and heal up a bit. Okay, he's about to attack block. Okay. He's gonna heal up again. Block. And do it again. See, this attack works really well. You just make sure you don't get too low. Block again, and we're gonna do it one more time. There you go, and block. Okay, now if I can. Dang it, he did that move. Yeah, okay, I'll be able to cancel out his rush. And I can hit him with the racer again. Now that I'm kind of low. This tactic does work, it's just I'm failing so hard because I'm so rusty. Yep, I'm dead. But we're gonna do that one more time just to show you guys. See, this works with all types of different stands, pretty much. So yeah, just keep that in mind. Man, I can't believe I got bodied that hard. Okay, let's see. How do I get the heck out of these sewers? 
yeah I'm not let's see I'm gonna go into here real quick so let's see purple haze could probably do it Aerosmith yeah Aerosmith yep cool experience I'm not sure most likely yeah sticky fingers most likely yeah mr. president wouldn't work so probably not Light album maybe crazy diamond maybe probably not killer queen most likely hermit purple most likely harp and green yes Harvard and Green's OP, Silver Chariot, maybe. Cream, yes, and of course they're Platinum, and the world would be great because they could do this off. So pretty much every stand, except for just a select few, would be able to do it. So just pretty much any stand. Honestly, I would say the handle's the easiest to do this with, but since I'm so rusty, it seems like it's not. But trust me, it is. It just does lots of damage. Let me find the... Oh yeah, Dash is old. Okay, good to know, good to know. Let's just head back on over to Diavolo. Yeah, I don't know why I did that. Yeah, we probably can do this. Like, we, as you can see, we got him to, like, almost half with just two hits. And then we can do the tactic, of course. Yeah, this, this is just super OP. It's just beyond, like, OP, this tactic. I don't know if a lot of other players use this, but I definitely do. Someone else is fighting him. Interesting. Are they down there? Yeah, what are they using? They're using D4C. I'm not going to interfere. But they might... Oh, they've got friends. Or no. <laughs> Bro, that's just their clones. Oh, they do have one friend, though. Oh, they're about to kill him. There you go. Uh, let's see if we can, uh, we'll just wait for him to respawn. But yeah, Xando is super OP. It's really just such an overpowered Xando. If you can get two hits on a player, they're almost, like, guaranteed dead. Like, that's just how it is. So, uh, we're gonna wait for him to respawn right here. It's taking a while. I'm gonna grab the quest right here. There's also another storyline quest on there. Um, uh, what's his name? I can't even remember his name. Wow. Wow. I, I still can't remember his name. Wow. I keep trying to think of Jorno. Uh. I, I can't think. You know, I'm not even gonna. I'm not even gonna. So, um. Why is he taking so long? The heck? There he is. Okay, so now we're gonna dash to the ladder. So you can see down there. We're gonna get up on the ladder as soon as he stops rushing. Okay. I'm just making sure these guys don't interfere just to prove that we can do this. Usually I would help my friends with this, so it was a lot. It was a lot easier. So there we go. Then hit him again. Hit the racer we missed. That's okay. Knock this down. That's okay. Back up to full. I'm gonna wait for that thing to go away. Okay, so we're gonna go up the ladder again. Not gonna risk it. Honestly, it's just smart to play safe. There's no reason to be aggressive. Let's go ahead and close. Okay, I'm gonna block. Get that thing out of my screen because I can't see. And yeah, I, I unclosed by accident. There we 
go. We pretty much got him dead. I'm gonna hit him with the vampires. Uh oh, we don't want him walking off the edge. Okay, we're good, we're good. Just call out our scan and rush him and he's dead. Okay, there, see? So, it is possible to do it other stands. The handle's probably the easiest. And, um, yeah, that's just pretty much it when it comes to... There's just that, that, that basic tactic pretty much works for every stand. Now, when it comes to sex and pistols, if you're trying to main him, honestly, I won. And a really good tactic would be if you're going to want to main a Pacific stand, like sex pistols, for, like, um... Uh, what you call it, steel ball run or something? Um, if your stand is not not like super rare, like the world or room experience, something like that, then you can just get rid of it and get a better stand, like I did. Like I made my friend get Zahando, and then he killed Diavolo really easily, and then we had him get a stand back, which is going experience, and it was really helpful. So honestly, it's just up to you guys what what you want to do with this tactic. You can pretty much do anything. You can have friends help you. But yeah, if you can just master this tactic, you'll be perfect. But yeah, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and bye-bye.